Hello friends, it's Jim O'Rear. Welcome back to Jim O'Rear's Wacky World. We are in Williston, Florida at Cedar Lakes Woods and Gardens. This is a gosh, century old uh, abandoned quarry that's been turned into a 20 acre botanical garden. It's amazing and beautiful. And if you don't know about this place, you need to come see it. Check out the website for more information about where it is and how you can see it. But we are going to give you a quick little tour. We're not going to show you everything because there's a ton, but this should give you a taste of what it's like to visit this location. This is the entrance to Cedar Lakes Woods and Gardens. And just from that basic sign, you would not imagine you're going to see sites like this. Beautiful, beautiful sites in this botanical garden. Cedar Lake Woods and Gardens was founded by Dr. Raymond Weber, and it opened to the public in January of 2014. But the creation of the gardens actually began over 32 years ago when Raymond discovered this 100-year-old retired lock, lime rock quarry. And... Um, he found that the property had actually been abandoned a long time ago, and it was just left as this polluted swamp. So he went ahead and purchased the property for his own private use, initially intending it to be used as a giant fishing pond. He just kind of dug out what was left, including the old mining remnants, and began to transform it. Now, rock by rock, he rolled in different uh, elements by wheelbarrow and strategically placed all of the, the rocks by hand um, to create these walkways and walls and uh, you know the things that surround the gardens. So with a small team of workers, he created different islands throughout the quarry and concrete walkways, separate pools, waterfalls, pavilions, gazebos, and bridges made of Brazilian walnut. So Ray kind of took on gardening then as a hobby and um, added greenery to the creation. And he discovered that he was just as enthusiastic for gardening as he was for fishing. And now he's responsible for one of the most unique botanical creations that you're ever gonna see. In 2014, Ray created a nonprofit Cedar Lakes Woods, Woods and Gardens, Inc. and donated the entire 20 acre botanical garden to the nonprofit and opened it to the public. Uh, he then donated the entire 64 acres surrounding woodlands to the Conservation Florida in order to keep them protected in the future. So while the property has strayed far from its original purpose, Ray is happy to see the property growing and being enjoyed by so many people. Now, while I was kind of just walking through the woods, um, I watch a lot of horror movies. And, well, you know... Something that happened in a horror movie that did not have a good ending was um, this right here. Yes, I've seen this movie and, and it did not have a good ending. Um, there is a pet cemetery and you'll notice that they've made these little crosses out of cement and, and rocks and they've got little name tags for, for the pets and what they were and all that cocker spaniels and snakes and rabbits and just all kinds of pets there and i guess it's okay since uh you know this isn't an indio an indian burial ground so i'm i'm sure it's it's safe but uh but it's a it's a cute little little area and speaking of pets look at this tiger tortoise look at him how cute is he <laughs> wandering around there and then this other guy, he was just kind of back here wanting to, to sleep. Yeah. <laughs> now the walls are lined with concrete and rock planters, and it's filled with hundreds of species and plants and flowers. And um, it's just, uh, you know, and it's home to tons of domesticated animals, uh, including cats and uh, two swans, several ducks, pheasants, a goose, a squirrel named Delilah, a cockatoo named Rosie, lots of koi fish. There's a 100-pound blue catfish named Big Ben that's in there. And all of these cool trees, you know, like we just showed you that 500-year-old tree. Um, here's a Japanese garden and falls. And you can just wander and wander through this 20 acres and see so many cool sights so much beauty so many different types of plants and animals this is a very cool 142 year old bonsai tree sitting right there so um that's just a brief look 
at some of the stuff here at Cedar Lakes Woods and Gardens, it is definitely a stop that you want to make. There you have it. That is a look at Cedar Lakes Woods and Gardens in Williston, Florida. What an incredible, incredible, peaceful, beautiful piece of property. If you are in the area, definitely make time to stop here. Great photo spots, just a, a great atmosphere. Definitely check it out. So I hope you've enjoyed watching this video. If you have, click that like button to let the powers that be know that you like the video. And while you're at it, click on follow or subscribe, and you'll be notified when I upload new videos. So thanks again for watching, and we'll see you next time.